happy Tuesday, Sound Jersey. It's meteorologist Joe Martucci. We are starting our day chilly here. November in full force with wind chills in the 20s here. The only place that isn't in the 20s is in lower Cape May County. Cape May bubble doing its thing here, but otherwise it is a chilly morning and you do want to bundle up heading out the door. Now temperatures stay below average for today, just like they were on Monday here. Temperatures for our highs at Atlantic Sea International Airport were just around 51 degrees. Tuesday, we're going to be around 54 our day. Then we go off the thermometer. And then here comes the crash as we go into Friday here. So we got a King to Cod like swing between Wednesday to Thursday to Friday here in South Jersey. We will get warm as we go into the middle part of the week because we have this big blue high pressure system bring a southwesterly wind around it. And that jet stream, the river of air that separates two air masses, will stay to our north, allowing for warmer air to come in not only from the surface, but in the upper levels as well, and then trickle on down. Our next shot of rain won't be until Thursday here. It's a line of rain that moves through the area. Here's 4 o'clock. Here's 7. We start to get into it now, staying into the evening hours, and then by 1 a.m. it'll be gone. These hours could change. Could be a couple hours earlier, a couple of hours later, but the point is it's going to be a brief line of rain and no flooding issues with this. Going into early next week, we have our travel week coming up does look like the first couple of days, Monday and Tuesday, will be a little bit rocky. This is a look at our height anomalies at the 500 millibar level. This is 500 millibars, which is air pressure. 500 millibars is about the center part of our troposphere, the lowest layer of the atmosphere. We can see these blues here means more than likely it's going to be cooler and it's going to be stormier as well. And you see Monday and Tuesday, you see those blues here in South Jersey. We are probably talking about a storm system for the early part of next week. Thanksgiving itself does look to be dry at this time, although we'll be on the chilly side. Here's a look at our bus stop forecast. We're rising through the 30s, just to around 40 degrees by 9 a.m. Jeans and a jacket will do. You're gonna want the extra layer on as we go into the daytime hours on Tuesday. Temperature staying below average. Now, it will feel a little bit milder than our Monday because we don't have those winds and we don't have the cloud cover. We will have the sun shining and that will mean good weather for outdoor events. Going into our Tuesday night, low temperatures will be all over the place. 31 in Woodbine, but you go over to Seattle City, we're 41 degrees. This is because we have calm winds, we have a clear sky, and we have low dew points, which promotes something called radiational cooling, where the heat from the day can escape straight into outer space pretty easily. But in South Jersey, and really in New Jersey, we have a couple of interesting features. We have the pine barrens with its sandy soil which accelerates that process so weymouth below freezing at 31. we also have the ocean and the bays which carry milder than what our land temperatures would be air and that means milder at the shore so 41 in atlantic city and we see the same story here in ocean county where it's 34 in stafford 43 over in Barnegat Light. Going into our Wednesday, temperatures on the upper side of seasonable here. We're in the upper 50s everywhere here. Mix of sun and clouds for our Wednesday. And here's a look at our inland seven day forecast. There is that Thursday and 70 degree mark there as we go just into a couple of hours of dry weather before that front comes through late in the day. Going into our Friday, weather whiplash. Temperatures come crashing back down. We have strong winds out of the north and west. Temperatures will be around 50 degrees for our high, and that's going to linger into the weekend here. So we have a chilly weekend on tap here in South Jersey. And as we go into Monday, we're watching that storm system, which could linger into Tuesday as well. We're going to talk more about that storm system and more about the warm air to come. You can go to our website, pressofac.com weather for the latest. And you can sign up for my newsletter there or give me a follow on social media.